I did. Get the stick. There's lots of great kids up here, Pete. I think I've seen a lot of films that deal with the coming of age of boys, but where are the stories about girls? I just don't see them, and I haven't seen many films, especially out of English Canada, that reflect my experience, and that was a big, big part of why I wanted to make Porcupine Lake. I'm sort of exploring a time in life that's very fleeting when you're around 12 or 13 years old and you just want to make a best friend, someone that gets you. You want to find that soulmate more than anything else in the world. And it's a story about these two girls that find each other and I think ultimately it's a love story. It's a big responsibility to work with actual 13 year olds. These are girls who have never had their first kiss in real life. Kiss me. I had my first kiss with a girl. I think whether you're a lesbian or you're straight, I think that it makes sense to explore and experiment with someone that you trust and with someone that feels safe and, um, and that, that sometimes is born out of a friendship. I think that's so natural and normal and healthy and I wanted to put that forward. I think that um, this is what we do and it's a beautiful thing. This is my favorite place. You're the first person I've ever brought here. The first day that we were filming, it was like a scene early on in the film and Kate and B were just, like, they'd just met and that like literally we just met that day. <laughs> so um, all the chemistry throughout the film in terms of like the friendship and how familiar we were with each other was really um, in sync with real life. And I remember as me and my mom were pulling up to come into the um, campground, my mom pointed out that she's like, I think that's Kate. And I was like, oh gosh. And I was like really nervous to meet her and everything because I know that we were playing best friends. And I was really, really worried that we weren't gonna have sort of natural chemistry but yeah we went we went into Charlotte's cabin and we just like talked for a good half yeah. hour and then went off to film our first scene I feel like we could be sisters do you feel that yeah it's not that complicated when you're that age. You're experiencing things for the first time and it is overwhelming and it is completely consuming. But it's the adults that make it complicated. You know, it's other people's fear and their projection of something being taboo or unfamiliar. It's their fear that makes it complicated. Hey, I know a secret hideout. My dad says we shouldn't go off the path. Do you always do what your dad says? Come on. I mean, there were a lot of adults around this script when I was writing it and when I was trying to pitch it, I thought they were afraid of this material because it was two young girls, which made me just want to tell the story even more. You know, it's, it's, it's surprising to me that we don't see more of these stories. And I think it's time. You know, more women are making films. Our gaze is getting out there. Now with the technology, we can get out there and tell our stories. We see some incentives to support more women telling their stories. And I hope we start to see more young girls on screen because uh, they're the future. Oh, I just think you and Kate have been spending a lot of time She's together. She's my best friend. <laughs> <Gotcha>. <laughs>